I'm out on the lake today ice fishing again and uh, I'm all set up I got here this morning at about 7:30. I already caught one small pike over here in this bay and I uh, decided I'm gonna do a little review on the ice shanty today it's kind of a unique shape and we did that because you have more shoulder room the base is 4x8 just one sheet of plywood it's resting on top of supports 2x4s and those 2x4s are notched into 2x6 skis down on the bottom the walls on the, the widest point up here this is about five feet high uh, from the floor inside shoulder height that's six foot wide we added one foot on each side so it doesn't just come straight up four by eight that shape right there gives us more shoulder room it also provides a little bit of comfort for these benches this bench here folds up and this side here we call the jump seat folds down these pins drop in here so the legs don't get kicked kick back on you and you can see the angle of it you're sitting a lot comfortable you can lean back against the wall and be comfortable instead of sitting on a hard instead of sitting on a hard straight flat surface you can lean back a little bit the peak is about 90 92 inches tall um, in the middle so you've got plenty of room in here three people can sit on this bench and uh, we keep firewood underneath a little buddy heater that is if we get out here and want to knock the edge off in the shanty real quick we can fire that up real quick while we go outside and set up once we're all set up we come in and start up our our wood stove homemade wood stove all right this is our wood stove for the ice shanty it's made out of an old propane tank basically we just cut our square right here and um, then took some flat steel and bent it to shape and tacked it around there put a metal hinge on one side I think the handles made out of a uh, old chip and hammer their damper down here which is also the clean out got a wrench on there a couple pieces of pipe and uh, it's a three inch chimney just goes right up through the metal roof but we added these rocks onto here uh, and this grating wasn't here this is new this year but that helps hold the heat and um, what we're having a problem with is with such little pieces of wood that fit in here it would get hot and as soon as that fire would go out you'd start getting cold so we put those rocks on there and it seems to be working pretty well right now we are 94 degrees in here so it's plenty warm That bucket stays hanging there all the time because the way that the, the uh, damper here and clean out is built, the ashes will fall out of there every now and then. We don't want them on the floor. The base is an old Christmas tree stand. And that's it. Pretty efficient little stove. Mm -hmm. 